Hey guys, I recently went to Canada. Oh, Canada. That's all I know. That's all I know of the anthem. Sorry, fill it in from here. I went to Montreal. So of course I went to Espastrico and then I went to Quebec City and I had no plans of going to a local yarn shop but I ended up finding some yarny goodness. So come along with me to Oh, Canada. Let's go. We got in the car and we drove north. Hello! We drove to Canada. Canada! Specifically, Montreal. Montreal. <laughs> and our very first stop on our trip is Espastrico. How did I do? How did, did I say it right? Can you say Espastrico? You're the, you're the expert. Oh, she gone. My daughter is the expert on French yep. pronunciation. Yeah, Look, it's me. Jason Glass Knits. Je m'appelle Olive. Hey honey, tell us about the Australia yarn store experience. Talk about that. It was excellent. They were all very nice. They um very helpful. Enjoyed my time very much. Did was there were you were you looking at the yarn like I want to buy that yarn or were you just Yeah, I want I want that yarn and I want that yarn and I want that yarn and oh. I want that yarn. Did you see any samples that you're like I there wish There was so much yarn. I wish I could have that sweater. All of it, all of it for you. Or that yarn. Yeah, that's how it was. Jason's been trying to tell me I have too much yarn. I'm not sure what that's about. <laughs> it's, it's the road's under construction right now, but look at this, there's cute little neighborhoods. It actually reminds me a lot of the north side of Chicago. She's, she's sitting on a big bike. See these cute little houses? We're here, we're already here. Okay, here's the shopping center complex. Look at this really cute shop across the way. That's really cute. <gasps> Look, I see it. How do we get up? Do we go up the stairs? Okay. Here it is. Okay, here we go. Just go up the stairs. Needles are so cool, but they are really grippy. Like they grip a lot, but aren't they beautiful? Mm -hmm. I think these might be the most beautiful knitting needles. Look at these drawers. They're full of needles. <gasps> oh my gosh, it's like heaven. Yes. Hold on, I just want to look at all the yarn they have. Look at these. I just love that they are packed with yarn. Like everything is packed with yarn. So pretty, like, I know, you want to touch everything. Okay, what about this section? This is their little like station where you can find a pattern. I've never done anything with this yarn. I know, isn't I know, I love the stations. Okay, oh look, did you see the hedgehog wall yet? Look, here's the Zauber balls. Oh, this one's pretty. Madeline Tosh, yeah. Look at these. These are pretty. Oh my gosh. What are you And then I was like, stop it. They have toys so that the moms can shop. When I saw that, I was like, are you serious right now, Pippa? Isn't this the best yarn store ever? Isn't this the best yarn store ever? Oh my goodness. I know, look. Oh, look at, look at the koi goo wall. Oh yeah? The one that you got from Danny? Look at the koi goo wall though. Oh my goodness. The koi goo wall. Look, I got the owners to show up. They're being responsible. They have been jet setting all over Europe all summer, so they haven't had a podcast That's right. in like months. I know, yeah, but we put it in record. Hopefully, we were planning tomorrow, but I think it might have to wait. Oh, that's okay. And look who's here. You're on it. Oh my gosh, this is the dyer behind Tannis Fiber Arts. Look at, he's here. This is who Tannis married because he actually appreciated a sweater, and that one guy wouldn't. Look at this. It's coming right here. Look at the highlighter one. 
Oh my goodness. Go, I mean, go, you know, go. You know that we are the only, um, we're the only shop that sells tennis. You are? We are. How privileged are we? You are privileged. We're so privileged. Look at this. It's just too beautiful. <gasps> take it out. Yeah. Look at the highlighter. Stop. So this is, because uh, we've ordered worsted and DK. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's going to be hard to Look, tell. there's yeah. more. <gasps> oh my goodness. Sorry. Yeah, you can just leave it there. So Look at this. You hand deliver it, Chris? That's so I know. impressive. Yeah. Chris, is there, is there more? Yeah, they're so <laughs> <up here>. Poor <laughs> Chris. He's so I'm like, surprise, so you're on the video. I'm not asking. <laughs> look at that. Yeah, it's it's like, like Christmas. Look at no. you, and look at you. You're just like, let me stock it right now. Yeah, this yeah. is because I'm I'm the I'm the bin uh, the bin manager here. Yeah. <laughs> just check Emily. Yeah, and just a GK. I give everybody a dollar if they get rid of a bin. For every bin they can get rid of, they get a dollar. I love it. Well, you guys have it stacked to the ceiling. Well, bin management, we have no overstock. This is our whole inventory. We have that's, no backstore. If it's out, we have store. it. Yeah. That's the back store that's right the there. Back store right there. So we need to sell more yarn to get rid of more bins. Yeah, <gasps> this is so pretty. Look at that. Right, is there more, Chris? Or if it's right, I don't Oh, so she. Oh, okay. So fleece, fleece, fleece artisan handmaiden are now the same company, and they so, made one for each province. Yes. So there's um, each each uh, province is represented by a national park, and um, so you you have the names of the national parks. Oh yes. And then the province, like for example, so like Forillon is a national park in the Gaspe, mm -hmm. Quebec, and then. They were inspired by the gray cliffs of Mont Saint Alban and mm -hmm. meadows of, of fi fireweed. So that's the Quebec that's one. That's the Quebec. And then you see, this is what it looks like knit up. Oh, cool! It's really special. I love that. I do. You have any more of well, this? Well, we have a few left. Of course, we have no Quebec. We have yeah. uh, we have a few provinces left, yeah. and we have another order coming in a in a month or so. That's so great. So that was a really beautiful way to sort of knit together, knit the country together. You I know? love it. And it's really nice. So that's I love that. Fun. So that's really nice. Oh my gosh, this is so smart. Lisa was just showing me some of the local um, yarn, so I thought I would show some. What did you find? Where's this from? Oh, that has no label. We have some tannis right here. She's got some fingering weight. Some, they were saying it really well. I say Julie Aslin, but they say it really well. Is this Julie? Yeah, Julie Aslin. Ju Julie Aslin. Mom, please stop trying. There it is. Look, these are the DKs. Oh, these are really pretty. Is this her too? Mm -hmm. this is the, the, this oh, one. that's really pretty. I like these. Ooh, those are really nice. So those are uh, some local stuff. I like this color. Okay, so Art Fill is really cool because the process that she uses to dye is like really eco-friendly because she uses a spray bottle so there isn't so much like runoff and hurting the environment. So aren't these beautiful? This is Art Fill. Let's get a picture of that. So. Ooh, look at this, Marina, Manos. Oh, Manos is so nice. Feel that. Isn't that pretty? Look at this, Manos. Oh my goodness. Okay, all right, then look at this. Ooh, that's pretty. Oh, that's pretty. I'm deciding between these three. Ooh, those are nice. Okay, so Lisa was just showing me her her notions bag. This is by Jessabel B. It's just like it's like origami, you know. It's mm -hmm. like here. Let me show you. Okay. Did you guys do this on your podcast yet? <laughs> I don't know. Have we? Maybe we, we have, have to. Maybe I haven't watched yours in a while. Well, we haven't had a podcast in a while. That's why I haven't I seen it all summer. What? Because, because they've been traveling. Traveling European road travelers. But we're we're doing one this week. You're so fancy. Okay. We're doing one this week. So that's it with my little pen. Okay, open it though. Oh yeah, open it. Sorry. See? See and look at that! All oh, my little See? beauties, and then I just have it all there, and my spastic. Oh, oh, yeah, a little branding here. Little Let's branding. do a little branding here. Hold on, focus. focus. There we go. There we go. Is that a highlighter? It is. I think I need one of pink. those too. Pink, pink, pink yeah. highlighter. Yeah, and you can get a travel version too. Isn't that cool? Yeah. And then there's this big huge thing over there. But I think I need to get the DPN case. Look okay, at this. Let's, let's close it first. Let's <gasps> this would make. Oh, yeah, show how it works. Oh my gosh, this would make me so happy. So, okay, show. It's this size. Yeah. Open it. Okay, and then you open it and look. And look. Like, oh, this is the, this is the <gasps> circular. Oh my. Oh, this is the circular no, one? No, yeah, I want is, the DPN yeah, one. Yeah, that's the DPN. This is the circular. Oh, that's one. circular. Okay, and yeah, this is DPN. Oh, yeah, logo. I see the difference. Yeah. So she actually um, yeah, this she is took all my DPNs. Because <laughs> I, I was like, I want all of my DPNs in one case. Yeah. 
none of this like m multiple cases and so, so she took all my dpns and she she tested all her sizing. So you're the one who made this prototype happen. I am the one who made <laughs> both of these prototypes happen. Yes. And even here, like, look at this circular. Yeah. You have, you have like one, two, yes, three, because, four, five, six. Because sometimes you need <laughs> you all. Need, you, yes. Sometimes you need six levels. I times love the three. levels. <gasps> and then you can put multiple per level. Oh my God. Trust me. I'm obsessed. I what do you think? What do you think spot. of the cases? I love it. Yeah. They're beautifully, they are beautifully made. They're really. Uh, they're yeah. sturdy, and they're you know what? They lie here. flat because how many times I do you know. have cases where things fall out? I know. I feel like an infomercial, but seriously, <laughs> that's what my channel is all about. <laughs> Info. <laughs> Buy the stuff. Okay, I'm it getting this. Amazing. Filled with double pointed needles. I'm so happy. I had all my collection. Oh yeah, what what did you have in there? I had all my uh, lantern moon yeah. ebony yeah. and uh, two fell out. Oh, in my bag. Oh, okay, so I'll need to. So I have. Oh my gosh, okay, yeah, I'm getting this. And then a little I love the way they put the books too. It's just visually stimulating. Oh, hey, there she is. She woke up now. There she is. Okay, where are we? Say it in a really good French accent. Montreal. Again? Montreal. Oh, no, I don't, I don't say it like that. I say Ma Montreal. All right, do you want to see what we got from Espatrico? Say yes. it. Oh Wanna see what we got? Okay, let me show you. All I've got this locally made. Oh, there's something in here. Project bag with a pin. We got highlighters, buttons. Hmm, Lisa snuck some stuff in there. Now I had to go, I'm trying to do something with mohair at some point someday. So I was like, yep, sparkly pink, yes. So I don't know what I'm gonna make, but I had to get this. This is some Rowan. Sparkly mohair, okay? And then I had to get one of the national parks. I had to. So here it is. This one is uh, N. This is the, it's called Sermilic. That's the name of the uh, park. Thought it was really pretty. So I got that. All have picked out these, I can't say it really well, Julia Celine. Did I say that right? No, I didn't. But look how pretty this is because these speckles are the same color as the semi-solids. Isn't that great? She did a great job with that. And then Lisa was so generous. She gifted me the DPN case by Jessabel B, which I'm so excited to fill it up with my DPNs. I'm so excited. Oh my goodness, I keep ending up with free Jessabel B stuff. Jessabel herself sent me my little like walking, knitting, like mobile case purse. And then Melissa at Espas Trico, they gifted me this gorgeous DPN case. And now that I'm home, I have filled it up. Now this is so cool, there's pockets here. So I have my loom in there. Look, my loom fits in there. Hey, loom. And my needle gauge right in there. Look, there it is. Okay, and then we open it up. Look at this. <gasps> All my DPNs and they're organized and they fit and I can just be like, there's all my fives because you guys before, I just had them in this really disgusting Ziploc bag and they were all floating together. I tried to keep them a little organized for one second, but then I just couldn't. So look at this gorgeousness. I can keep, this is every single DPN I own. Every single one except for the ones that are lost, which there are definitely some that are lost or, Maybe elsewhere. And I guess Lisa had a hand in uh, designing this. And you guys, just Paul, Lisa, you did a great job. Look at this. Watch. Just rolls right up. Mm-hmm. Yep. Done. Done. All my DPNs in one spot. I'm so happy. I love it. Hey, Espas Trico girls. Thank you so much for having me. And when you guys come to Montreal, you have to stop in. You have to stop in. Huh? We were just walking down the street in Quebec City and we saw this wool shop and as I'm leaving and we're taking all this video, I saw this sign that said, no pictures please. <laughs> she didn't seem to mind. But look, see all this nice, cheapy, wooly goodness? This is the store and uh, I'm gonna take you inside.
things. Should we show? I'll show the couple things we got. We got a little ornament. Because when we go on family trips, we get an ornament as a souvenir instead of like other things that we might really not care about once we're home. And I got a little key ring. This little ornament, it's like a little puff ball with a head on it. We got this key ring. It has a little sheet with the heart. Isn't that cute? But she felt it, and here's all the info right here. Okay, I found the alpaca store. And uh, they had a lot of cool stuff, and I'm really glad they had yarn for sale and Brittany needles. So we'll just go in. It's the, this is the alpaca. I can't say these French things. Is that backwards? Probably is, right? It looks like super legit, though. Canadian woolly finds. I had a great time. It was a very like impromptu, let's go to Canada trip. So I didn't have a lot of planning uh, time, but I did end up finding some woolly goodness and I'm super stoked about it. So thanks for coming with me as always. And thanks for checking in to Christy Glassnets. Bye. Where are we again? Quebec City. What country is that in? Um, Canada. <laughs>